Welcome back. You've joined us on 9XC The Show. So a few days ago, actress Rati Agnihotri alleged that her husband, businessman Anil Virwani, abuses her mentally and physically. She filed a complaint after seeking support from a political party. The police said, Rati Agnihotri, who married Anil Virwani in 1985, filed a complaint against him on March 14th, saying he had mentally tortured her besides assaulting her physically. A case has been registered against Virwani under IPC sections 498A, husband or relative of husband of a woman subjecting her to cruelty, 323, voluntarily causing hurt, 350, use of criminal force, and 506, criminal intimidation. S. Jai Kumar, Deputy Police Commissioner. A source says that Anil Virwani was going through financial trouble and Rati is a high maintenance wife. When 9XE The Show got in touch with Anil, he was as clueless as the rest of us. I had no clue whatsoever. I got to know only about half an hour, 40 minutes after you told me. There were like calls after calls. And then I realized that there has to be something. Else. It can't be like a stupid joke or a rumor, you know. And it's not even funny to be a joke. You get my point or not? There's nothing funny about it, you know. And as of right now, I do not even have any clue why the hell she has gone and done this. Rati filed a verbal complaint on the 7th of March, but the events prior were nothing out of the ordinary. On six nights, we're out at the York club having dinner with all our friends and on 7th this year she goes and uh, from the uh, goes and gives an oral complaint and on 14th the written complaint does it make sense on 8th we are supposed to go to Ali Park with friends who were there at dinner they invited us before anybody could put their hand up Rati put her hand up however Anil's side is that Rati has a bad temper and her behavior towards her friends too has been off must be in her mind no more than anything she is I mean, she has done that in the past, not just with me, but even with some close friends and family people and all that. But nothing to be made an issue. I mean, I am I'm just totally shocked. I am totally appalled, shocked, beyond words. Rati continues to live in Anil's home, but Anil says that he can't try to patch things up because he is not even allowed to talk to her. She she was not in town. She was in Lunala. You understand? She's come back yesterday. and uh, But she's uh, all the time got uh, people around her and I've been advised not to talk. After the people who have read the campaign, you understand? Because anything will be blown out of proportion. Don't utter a voice. Anything in a sheet talks, you just shut up. Their son, actor Tanuj, is shaken by the accusations as well. Tanuj, we can't shooting him. What can I say? He's definitely disturbed. But I don't want to tax him and tax him. Let him do his work. Rati and Anil's case of domestic violence is not the first one in Bollywood. While there are many cases simmering under the surface because those involved are too afraid of losing face in society, many women have spoken up about it and have had the courage to leave their abusive relationships. When Preeti Zinta filed her complaint against her former boyfriend Ness Wadia, she said that she feared for her life. In a letter to Mumbai's police commissioner Rakesh Maria, she wrote, Ness's behavior towards me is getting more and more aggressive and violent over a period of time. From throwing burning cigarettes at my face to locking me up in rooms and manhandling me, I have seen it all with him. I just want him to be kept away from me so I can live in peace. Otherwise, one unfortunate day, in a fit of rage, he will kill me and that really scares me. When Kangana Ranaut first entered the industry, she had to face many hardships. She filed a complaint against her alleged partner, Aditya Pancholi, who forcefully entered her home and threatened her. Model Rhea Pillai accused her live-in partner, tennis ace Leander Pace, of domestic violence. She stated that Leander and his father had prevented her and her child from entering their home. TV actress Shweta Tiwari has been vocal about her relationship with ex-husband Raja Chaudhary, who was abusive towards her. Dimpi Ganguly now might not have much to say against estranged husband Rahul Mahajan, but she had previously said that his short temper resulted in a violent marriage. Pooja Bhatt has said that her former boyfriend Ranveer Shori used to raise his hand on her under the influence of alcohol. TV actor Shalin Banot has been accused by his estranged wife, actress Daljeet Kaur, of domestic violence. So when 9XE The Show spotted him at an event, we raised the issue of domestic violence. Where does that leave you then? What's your stand on the accusations of violence in your own marriage? My personal life, Daljeet's personal life, 
इट्स आर लाइफ है ना वी डोंट लेट एनी बडी इन टू इन आर लाइफ हमने कभी नहीं बोला कि हमारे बीच में प्रॉब्लम है ना उन्होंने बोला ना मैंने बोला हमने कभी ये नहीं बोला कि हमारे बीच में प्रॉब्लम नहीं है वो हमारी प्रॉब्लम है मेरी गाड़ी में भी खराब है पता है आपको मैं आपको बता रहा हूँ देर हैव ऑल्सो बिन स्ट्रॉग विस्पर्स ऑफ सलमान खान मिस ट्रीटिंग द वेमेन इन हिज लाइफ हाउ एवर नॉट मच हैज बिन सेट अबाउट दिस बट वट प्रॉम्स पीपल टू रेज देर हैंड ऑन देर पार्टनर्स द वेरी सेम पीपल दे हैड वन स्वर्न टू लव एंड प्रोटेक्ट वी आर ऑल अंडर दर्क लाइट्स वी ऑल वॉन्ट टू बी अंडर दर्क लाइट शाइन ऑलवेज अंडर दर्क लाइट्स and jobs are also not very safe secure uh, roles in movies are also not safe and secure so what happens is uh, if there's a small small irritability a small reason it can explode to a big <coughs> explosion if if the small stresses are not handled domestic violence is actually a cry for help it's a cry of an anxious person who's not able to get his ways in a calm sensible appropriate manner so he decides that the only way to get is through aggression in the entertainment industry there aren't a lot of people who are willing to be open about this and talk to a counselor so what's the solution then two things i'd point out one is self confidence the more self confident i am about who i am what i am as a person the less i will be prone to domestic violence okay two the more i give others the right to be who they are not believing that just because i say something it has to be done okay the more i will reduce domestic violence however it's sad to note that women take advantage of the laws that are there to help them there are a lot of cases where women are unable to control their rage or are have are slightly affected mentally or they also if they are under the influence of alcohol what happens in case of a man can happen in case of a woman also and under such circumstances they are the ones who kind of really make i mean i have clients sometimes who come to me with bites okay so the wife has bitten them there are where people come where, where the wife has thrashed them in fact more men are seeking help in the realm of domestic violence than women are the truth behind the rati anil case will emerge only with time but it's a step forward for women when famous faces speak out against domestic violence coming up is emran hashmi's image makeover doing him more harm than good